Determining protein concentration. For this lab, you will need microfuge tubes, cuvettes, safety equipment, Kamasi Plus, bovine serum albumin, pipette and pipette tips, a vortex, a tube rack, and a marker. To begin the experiment, obtain six 1.5 milliliter microfuge tubes. Number the tubes from 1 to 6. Tubes 1 through 4 will be used for the standard curve. Tubes 5 and 6, along with the 2 mg per mil and 4 mg per mil tubes, will be used to explore the upper and lower limits of the curve. Prepare 6 dilution tubes starting from 2 mg per mil BSA. Calculate the amounts of BSA and distilled water needed to pipette into each microfuge tube to achieve 200 microliters of each using a two-fold serial dilution. Add the calculated amount of BSA to the first tube and then perform a serial dilution. The dilutions will have the following concentrations, 1 microgram per mil, 0.5 microgram per mil, 0.25 microgram per mil, 0.125 microgram per mil, 0.062 microgram per mil, and 0.031 microgram per mil of BSA, respectively, when completed. Place the tubes on ice. Set up and label 21 2 ml microfuge tubes. Two tubes will be for each sample and one will be for the blank. Obtain a bottle of Kamasi Plus. Add 1.5 milliliter of Kamasi Plus Bradford reagent to each of the 21 tubes. Pipette 50 microliters of the appropriate protein sample into each tube. The blank should get 50 microliters of distilled water. Cap the tubes, mix by inversion of the test tube or carefully on the vortex. Avoid bubble formation. Repeat for the remaining samples.
Wait at least five minutes for the protein and dye to bind. The complex is stable for about one hour, so be sure to read before one hour. Carefully pipette about 1 to 1.5 milliliters of the solution into your blank tube into the cuvette. Place the cuvette containing the blank solution in the cuvette holder in the spec. Be sure the arrow or clear sides of the cuvette are in the light path. Read the samples at 595 nanometers. Repeat for the remaining samples.